There we go. Okay, so you go to see a movie called Lover's Lane, a charming romantic story of two young lovers, and then it turns out that it's not because it's Lover's Lane, the movie that I produced, and it's a horror film. It's a teen horror film. And how do you feel about that? You probably feel pretty pissed, unless it turns out that you love horror films and it's okay, but what about that person that you dragged along on the promise that it was a, an uplifting romantic story, right? So we need to kind of know going in. Most people do. I'm psychotic, so for me, the perfect movie-going experience is if I walk into the theater knowing absolutely nothing about the movie, not even the title, which is what we used to be able to do now at USC because it was a class there where they would bring in a new film each week and film students were, it wasn't a film class, it was for the English department, but film students were allowed to go and, and see the films and you never knew what it was showing and it was great. But for most people, they don't want that. They want to know up front at least a little bit about what they're getting. So we create genre. And out of genre, that drives the whole business. So you go to AFM, and you see all these films in all these various genres. So now you're thinking, okay, how am I going to tell my story in a way that I can create a poster for it, that I can create the video box for it, that I can create the 30-second spot? And that sounds, I know that sounds, for a lot of people, it's going to sound horrible and, and, and soul-sucking, but you want your movie to be seen. That's why you're making your movie, to be seen and not seen just by 10 people, you know, your best friends and the crew and, and all that jazz. You want it to be seen by people all over the world. 